flow is an interesting thing. You know, you can either um, refocus yourself into the present moment, you know, get yourself in flow if, you, if you've got that, that capability. Uh, another one's challenge, just, you know, a challenge that's presented in front of you. And then anything to do with, you know, your life is on the line, you're definitely going to be in an acute state of flow. Any uh, Tier 1 Special Forces unit, you're training daily, you know, thousands of hours, day and night, to get as close as possible to realism as you can possibly get without the bullets flying back at you. We had our engines off and uh, we're just watching the convoy come up, they're about half a k away, and then we heard, you know, boom, 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 boom. It sounded like a machine gun crack off in the distance, about 800 metres out. Anyway, I just called shot, shots fired on my... Um, on my radio and then all of a sudden the the tracer rounds went straight over the over the top of us and they were quite big rounds and what we didn't know is what we were being contacted um by an anti-aircraft gun that they'd mounted up on top of a uh, wall so um i said instead of saying contact left which is you know what you should be saying i said oh, i think they're shooting at us <laughs> <laughs> um, a lot of people were saying hey jamie i think you've got a story to tell you should write a book and there was there was people both you know, inside the regiment and outside the regiment. The real push came when uh, a good friend of mine, Steve Askin, um, who I served in the squadron with, who I reference in the book as well, he went in and was killed, um, which was a massive hit. And, um, you know, to us and the boys personally, particularly me, because I'd, I'd operated very closely with him. His dad called me up and just said, hey, Jamie, can you write something about Steve as the soldier, you know, in the regiment, just to give to his kids so they understand who he was in that particular environment.